I have a GoPro Hero 9 Black here. I want to show you several ways to transfer your photos and videos to your MacBook or Apple computer. Okay, so several ways. So the first way, I, I'll show you how to do the cable last. That's, that's the one that I usually use. But the first way is this. You go ahead and pop the back door open and pull out the battery. And then you see the SD card here, which is where all your photos and videos are on. If you go ahead and pop this out, and then if you, if you have one of these uh, adapters for a micro SD card like this, you can pop that in here, just like that. Pop this right into your MacBook or Apple computer, and right away you can go ahead and transfer um, your photos and videos directly to your MacBook, okay? Another thing is too is uh, if you have one of these laying around, you can always pop this in here, but then you need like a memory slot reader that's usually on the side of your MacBook. You can slide that in and retrieve the data like that. If um, you have uh, this here, or if you don't have a memory, card, a memory card slot reader, you can also use like a, a double adapter. So I got one adapter here, I put my micro SD card in here, then have another adapter here. I can go ahead and plug this in here, and now I can plug this in my USB, and same thing, I can uh, like, uh, transfer my photos and videos like that. Now let me put my SD card back in and I'll show you how to do it with the cable. And this is the way that I transfer my photos and videos to my uh, MacBook here. All right, so now we're gonna use the uh, cable here. Now this is the cable that came with the uh, GoPro, but sometimes I use uh, my, my phone cables too. As long as it's a um, USB type C, uh, most of the time it'll work with the uh, GoPro too. But you can see, this, as long as it's a uh, USB type C connector. Okay, anyways, I just use the original right now for this video. What you want to do is, again, it's going to pop open the back door. You, you also want to make sure that it's off, okay? So go ahead and turn it off. And it doesn't matter if the battery's in or out. It doesn't really matter, okay? Anyway, pop the back door open. We're going to go ahead and plug it one end here. Now the other end, we're going to go ahead and plug this into the uh, USB port into your uh, MacBook or Apple computer. So let me go ahead and plug this in. Again, make sure that the GoPro is off, okay? Now watch this, okay? Now if you guys go ahead, now once I turn it on, Oops, let me turn it on here. Okay, there we go, now it's on. Okay, now this here, I mean now, you see this now, this all of a sudden here pops up, okay? I can transfer everything like this. The thing is, you're not gonna be able to do this on a MacBook. If you did this on a Windows PC, everything will pop up like this. However, on a MacBook, the easiest way, don't try no wild, wireless transfer, any of that stuff, guys, this is the easiest way to do it. You have to download this Android transfer um, uh, little thing here. Once you do that, download it once. Every time you pop it in, you'll be able to transfer um, you know, all of your uh, GoPro footage. So really quickly, you have to download. It's, it's the Android file transfer, okay? You have to download and install that. I'll put a link below in the description where you can download and install that. Just do that once, and then every time you go ahead and pop your... Um, your um, Connect your GoPro to your computer. Let me do everything over again, okay? So let me just show you. So let's just pretend that you go, you went on, you download it, and that's what it looks like there, the Android tra um, transfer file. So now, okay, first thing I got to make sure um, I have my GoPro off. So let me go ahead and turn it off. So it's off now. Let me go ahead and connect the USB now. And now I'm going to go ahead and turn it, turn it on, turn the GoPro on. Okay, now give it one second here. And I see the guy kind of like going up. Okay, so now this here pops up right away, okay? Now what I can do is, if, if a window doesn't pop up, I mean, you can just, just, just go down here and click it like this, and it's gonna pop up again, okay? And now you can see my GoPro, it says USB connected. Let me just leave that right there. Okay, now you can see right here. Now, if you look closely, it says DCIM. That's a DCIM folder, we wanna double click on that. And then this folder here, uh, 100, or it says GoPro here, this folder, double click on that. And then you can see all the, um, the photos and videos I have. J JPG is basically a photo. If it's as an MP4, then obviously it's a, um, it's a video. And then from here, you can do whatever you want. You know, if you, wanna, if you want this photo here, you can drag, you can drop this right onto your uh, desktop. You can see I just dragged it right there. Or you can select like multiple of them. You can, then you can go ahead and drag and drop. Or what I typically do is I'll go ahead and 
I'll go down to this finder right here. I'll click on that and this window here will pop up and then I'll go to the, like documents and then I'll go ahead and double click my uh, MacBook and I'll just make a new folder here. I'll just go to a new folder and I'll name it whatever. And now what I can do is just uh, drag and drop whatever I want. I can select everything or I can just, I can just pick and choose you know what I want. Let's see, I'll, I'll, how about these three right here? And then I'll just drag and drop this right into this folder that's here. So give this a second to transfer. Okay, it's complete. And then right here, I should have those three files right here. Okay, so pretty simple. Good luck.